everyone. This is Donna's Happy Hour. Just a reminder to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so that you get future notifications of the videos. And please leave a comment. Thank you. Have a great day. So, yeah. Let well, me I'm ask, happy. now, you, where do you practice? Uh, I'm mostly at, in, at my house. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. I have okay. a small, modest studio set up. Nice. But it works. The sound is really good. Yeah. And I think you yeah. don't give yourself enough credit. It's yeah. It's a nice setup. It sounds really good. And I think what we hear downstairs in Howard's in Howard's basement is kind of what we're hearing in our heads. Right. So it translates very well whenever we're playing out. Oh, so. that's great. That's yeah. yeah, that's really nice. So when did you start playing guitar? How old were you? Uh I could say thirteen or fourteen. I ended up I saw as a kid, I saw uh, Neil Young came out with Russ Never Sleeps oh, back okay. in I guess like the early eighties or late seventies. And uh the next day after seeing that movie and I went with some with my older brothers uh -huh. I asked my parents for a guitar so I was hooked I was like oh, I want to wow. do that I want to oh, learn how to play guitar so the next day we went over to a music store picked up a guitar took lessons wow. um, for a couple years and then just then moved into high school and, and was in bands in college and, right. and whatnot so right. I've always so I've played it you know but wow. since then so was anybody in your family a musician no, no. okay no. all right no. interesting yeah how about you Howard well, I started when I was about 15 okay. at a summer camp because oh. I was not much of a guitar player. Okay. And there were lots of guitarists, uh, mandolin, 12 string, you know. And so a friend took pity on me and handed me a harmonica from his <laughs> guitar case and said, you know, Howard, he was politely saying, why don't you, why don't you, there's nobody playing a wind instrument or a right. harmonica. It was, it was actually a way for me to stop playing the guitar. <laughs> Um, little did we know, did I know that I really picked up on the harmonica? Wow! And it, and it, 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 it you know, literally sang to me. Right, and, right. And from there, I just started That's playing amazing. And, and experimenting with it. And oh. Had a lot of fun with it. And Neil Young was a big influence right. on me with the harmonica. Right. But my first influence, since I'm a little older than Michael, with uh, when the Beatles came over, oh, that wow. was. That was like huge. Yeah, yeah. You know, oh, that yeah. that woke that kind of and the Stones, right? Right, you know, and the at Stones. At the same right. time, that kind of yeah. woke everybody up when it came yeah. to rock, oh, and God. and Did then you? with rock, you know, you, you you learned about the blues because that's right, right, because that was what they influenced right. them a lot too. You right. Know. So that was some of my very oh, early interesting. Instances. Now, did anybody in your household play instruments or? Well, my sister Melanie uh, had had a wonderful voice. Oh, uh, really? And and. That was she was just incredible. And one time she she and her band played at the Bitter End. Oh no many, kidding! Yeah, many, oh, many wow. years ago, and they did all the local events, and, and oh. she was wonderful. Oh that. wow! Yeah. Oh wow! Where and where did you grow up? Uh, Maplewood. Oh, New Jersey. Yeah, okay. Columbia all High right. School. Oh okay, because my brother um, sang for many years. I don't know if you ever heard of Pegasus or Leviathan. Mm. No. They had um, done all of a lot of Bergen County and mm -hmm. South Jersey and all of the areas for mm -hmm. many years. You know, they actually opened for a Three Dog Night. Nice. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. 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 Well, wow. I love the names of the band. I mean, very strong. You know. Like, yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. So it was uh, yeah. it was interesting, but he had an incredible voice, mm -hmm. and so um, I never really. I sang because I did theater, but it was always chorus. It was never mm -hmm. like a solo. Sure. And when I would hear him sing, it was like I didn't want to <laughs> sing because he just was absolutely amazing, yeah. you know. But um, yeah, so my thing was dancing. I, mm -hmm. I and uh, and I always Michael and I don't play. dance. No. <laughs> no. You don't want to see that. No, no yeah. you don't want to see that. I don't know. You know, I would thought maybe later on I could make you, you know, do a little something, but that's okay. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it's funny how you know I never learned an instrument either, and I always wanted to. So um, recently, I don't know where I was. Probably maybe, might have been actually. It was I do know where I was. I was on the set. I was doing a show, and um, some of my guests came in with a cajon, mm -hmm, and I sure. was like. I like that instrument. Mm -hmm. I think I could play that because basically, you know, it's mm -hmm. it's kind of like a bongo in a sense, mm -hmm. you know. And um, 
they've got all different types. I mean, you can sit on them, you know, you can, I, they've got all different shapes and sizes. And um, so I decided to get the one that goes in your lap because the one that you sit on, because mm -hmm. I'm very short, if you hadn't noticed, <laughs> and my arms weren't really long enough to like hit it the way somebody that has nice long arms sure. and you know mm -hmm. so i was like no nah, i gotta get the lap one so now i've taken to the cajon which for me is taking my dance background and just transferring it from my feet to my hands mm -hmm. which came very natural for me so i'm I very can, I can excited that. that i finally can say that i play an instrument yeah how do you practice really? or do you, do you play along to music or what do you i do? just play along to yeah awesome. yeah yeah. I would love to start, you know, and I keep saying that I'm going to bring it here and force the bands that come on here to let yeah, me yeah. play with them. Well, well, calls up, we'll interview you. <laughs> yeah, there we go. But um, 